Today we're going to take a quick look at a really great Google Chrome extension that will allow you to record and leave voice comments pretty much anywhere online, including right within Google Classroom. First we have to install the extension, so I'm going to do a Google search for talk and comment. I can click on the first response which will take me to the Chrome store. I'm going to click on Add to Chrome and Add Extension. You may be prompted to allow your microphone. If you are, simply allow it. And then you're all set to go. Now that you've installed the extension, you'll notice this small circular icon on the right-hand side of your screen. That will appear wherever you go on the internet. And by clicking on it, you will be able to start recording a voice memo instantly. Here's my first voice memo. Once you hit the check button, you will be given a link that will take you directly to that voice memo. The nice thing is this link can be shared through virtually any sort of social website you might be using, whether it's social media like Twitter or Facebook, or right within Google Classroom. Let's take a look at it in Google Classroom. Here I am in Google Classroom. You'll notice that icon is still here on the right-hand side, so I'm going to click on it to record a new voice memo for my students. Don't forget to review your notes for tomorrow's exam. Here's the link I'm going to use to share my voice note. I'm going to copy it and click OK. And now, in Google Classroom, I can create a new assignment or announcement. And where I would normally type my announcement, I'm going to paste that link. And then I'll hit Post. And what you'll see is pretty amazing. That link has automatically generated a little play button where students can click and hear my voice comment. Don't forget to review your notes for tomorrow's exam. You can also leave voice comments within class comments or even private comments for students right in Google Classroom. Of course, this works in all of the different Google apps and can be used in just about any website. Hope this helps.